Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's been a few weeks now since I've done a haul and today I'm really excited for this one. As you can tell by the title, it's not just a brown haul, it is a pink haul. I have been trying to film this video for so long now. I mean, just today. Although actually that's not even true. I've been trying to film this for weeks, but I've just not had any free time, which is also where the parcels are unwrapped um, because I've had to take content in it already. But yeah, I've been trying, to, trying so hard to film this today, but the lighting in this room is horrific. It's so bright and sunny in here. Like, I don't get it. Like, it should be good lighting, but like this little area here where I have to film, it's all like dark and shadowy. I mean, this is the best it's been, but I've tried so hard to get it like this. I just gave up and started filming TikToks for like an hour and I'm almost gonna be late for a baby shower now. But let's get started. Oh, I've got this pillow, I wanted it because it was pink, but I mean, it's uncomfortable, so I'm just gonna move it. So I'm not gonna be unboxing the things because I've already unboxed them and I wasn't gonna package them back up because I'm not that weird. So I've got two favorite items. I think I'm gonna do them first and last. And I'm kind of sad about these because they've got marks on them now and it makes me wanna cry because they are my favorite things ever. But I ordered these boots are you as in love with them as i am because oh my god i am so obsessed so yeah you can see i've like scuffed them there i don't know if you can see properly there's just like little marks on it will probably come off um and there's like a bit of scuffing there i've only worn them once but i mean it's probably my own fault because i was like oh there's all black marks on it as well oh i don't know if you can see that it's, they're really minor but i was wearing them to walk around and get content in um I was trying to be careful, but clearly I wasn't careful enough. I can't walk in heels, so maybe that was part of the problem. I've got a hair in my face. Oh, I've got long hair now. I don't think I've done a YouTube video since I've had long hair. Yeah, apologies for the lack of videos. I haven't filmed a haul in a while, but I did do the vlog, but nobody seems to like vlogs, so I don't know. I enjoy doing the vlogs. Yeah, I've just been so, like insanely busy with uni. Um, I'm doing my master's degree, I think most of you know but it's just been crazy. Anyway, um, back to the haul. So the first thing I got were these boots and I am so, so in love with them. These actually arrived like really early, like probably like a couple of weeks ago, but I didn't do any pictures or film them first because I wanted to save them. I wanted to save them for this haul, but then I just had to end up filming first. But they are the most gorgeous things in the entire world. And I've worn them for two outfits already. But, oh, I've been, oh, I'm like two minutes in and this haul is already chaotic. I'm going back again. So in like a few vlog, a few hauls ago, I said about that I was going to do either a green feed or a pink feed. And my pink feed is starting. When this video is up, it'll probably already be started actually, because I'm starting it tomorrow from when I'm filming. And I doubt the video will be up tomorrow. Um, I can try but I doubt it. Yeah, so the pink feed will probably have already started and that is why I've got a pink haul. Do I need to refilm this entire intro? I feel like I might do. I probably should have refilmed this, but because it's in like the worst order possible, but I'm just gonna go with it. And apologies for how chaotic it is. These boots are from La Moda. I will link them below. I'm so in love with these. I think like the little things I've done to it will be fine. <laughs> I think they will come off. Um, but yeah, they're absolutely perfect. And I'll be wearing these all the time, especially when I'm doing my pink feed. And through spring and summer, possibly not summer, they might be a bit hot for summer, but definitely through spring. I love them so much. Side note, while this is already chaotic, I may as well talk about something else entirely again. I was going to wear a pink outfit to do this in, but I mean, I've pretty much just got neutrals at the moment, apart from what I've ordered for my haul. So A, it's in the haul. And B, I was gonna take pictures in this this morning. I tried actually in my studio but I didn't set them in here like they were okay but I want to do some better ones but this is like my new favorite hoodie ever it's from Disora and it is just so comfy I put it on I was like oh, I love it so much oh I don't know if they still stock it I think they do like limited um collections but I bet like the next collection they do will be like equally as good so um I'm not entirely sure but I can link this as well and just know that if you get this you will not be disappointed right next item this is a little cropped blazer from pretty little thing this wasn't my favorite item i'm not gonna lie to you um i just the quality's not bad but compared to some of the other things i've got you get me so yeah this is from pretty little thing i wore this 
well you can see the picture right here i wore this with some green trousers because i thought it'd be like a cute little um color pop because even though i'm doing like a pink feed i feel like there'll be splashes of green in it this is a size six for reference oh i forgot to say about the boots but i mean you don't really need two sizes for reference i'm a size three so nobody's my size but yeah this is a size six and it fit quite nicely i'll try everything on again after like i normally do but yeah that's the little crop blazer so this top is from primark and i swear i don't normally ruin clothes but my dog has ruined this one <laughs> it wasn't his fault he'd got like a coat on last night because it was really cold and it's all like velcro on the bottom and the velcro like sticks to the top and it makes it go weird but you can't really tell i think it's fine still so this is from primark it's made from recycled materials and it is the softest thing ever. I've got this in so many colours. I think I've got like a um, like a yellowy creamy one. I've got two white ones, um, which I think was actually in my last vlog. Yeah, it was, it was in my vlog. Um, I've got another colour, what else have I got? I think it's just like um, like a sort of nude colour-ish, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, I've got this in so many colours because it's so nice. I have to say it doesn't last very long but it was three pounds so i'm literally not going to complain it's just a perfect staple and i like it going in from like winter to spring because it's quite thin but it's warm still i literally live in these tops they're so nice and i love that it's recycled so yeah this is a strong win the next thing i got is a tracksuit from boohoo this i mean obviously still fast fashion but this is also recycled so it is just a nice little jogger set like i like the cuffs at the bottom because they're not too tight um but i got the joggers in a size small they actually look huge they were big but they didn't look ridiculous on i don't think anyway these were super comfy and a really good buy so i'm really happy with these and this is the matching top they look quite bright on camera but they're actually not that bright so just simple sweatshirt and joggers but it's such a staple again like with the one like with the top from primark i like the way i styled this i'll put in the picture here yeah it's just such a simple outfit but you can make it look super cute so i'm happy with this one i'm going to show you some more accessories now so the next thing i got is this i didn't know whether to wear this outfit or not because i feel like it literally made me look like a cowgirl but it's super cute and it's a fluffy hat so i like it Again, I feel like this is another great transition item from winter to spring because it'll keep you warm, but it's like pastel-y and cute and yeah, perfect for spring. I can't remember if I said or not, but that was from ASOS. And this is also from ASOS. This is one of my favourites. It is so fluffy. Like, can you see how fluffy that is? I absolutely adore it. I haven't taken a picture in this one yet. This goes with another outfit that I'm going to show you. It's the last one I'm going to show you because it's my favourite. But I haven't managed to take a picture in it yet because... I want to go somewhere quite fancy for it, like a museum or just somewhere nice like that. And I feel like I'm going to have to go to London for that. Next up is this jumper. It's like a really nice like cable knit. It's so cute. This is from Misguided. It was gifted, but not for the purposes of this video. I just wanted to show you because it's cute and because it's pink. I actually wore this to uni the other day and everyone loved it. It's got like the little, I didn't notice when I ordered it. Probably I didn't clearly look well enough, but it's got like the two little pockets at the front and it's super cute i feel like i'm gonna wear this quite a lot especially like now because it's so cold outside but it's spring like i mean it's really not it's february still when i'm filming this but i like it and i think it's perfect for like again winter to spring transition it's a petite size it's like in the misguided petite range but i got a size six um i normally get a size like six to eight in tops so i don't know it fits just fine but if you wanted it oversized, then I'd possibly size up, especially because it's a petite um, range. I've only got three more things left to show you now. And next up is one of my favourites. It's not... Um, oh, you know what? It actually might be my favourite because I wear this all the time. I say that I've literally had it for like a week, but I've worn it so much already. It is my fluffy coat. It is so cute. Oh, this is also misguided petite. I didn't realise that. I got this in a size 8. And normally, actually, I get a size four in coats, so I'm actually not sure why I got a size eight. Maybe it was the only size left. Um, I'm not sure, but I'm glad I got that size. I can't remember what my reason was, but I'm glad I did because it fits perfectly. It only does up like once in the middle, so it's not as warm as it looks. But it was just because I wore it on a really cold day, so I think like generally it's fine. Like it is still. Oh, 
I'm so warm with it on my lap, it's like a blanket, but I think maybe don't wear it in the ice <laughs> like I did the other day. Yeah, super cute. I absolutely love this one. I will probably end up wearing this with nearly every outfit you see on my Instagram, so I hope you like it because it will be making a regular appearance. This was gifted as well, but yeah, same. It was in the same thing, like, um, it wasn't for the YouTube video. I love it so much. My second to last item are these heels from XY London. These were also gifted, but again, not for this video. So I'm going to be wearing this with the bag I showed you, the dark pink bag from ASOS, and my final thing that I'm about to show you for that picture, which I feel like I'm going to have to go to London for. I think these are super cute. They, um, they've got like the long straps, so they like wrap around your leg and they look so cool. I can't walk in heels to save my life, but these are actually so comfy. When I was gonna do my pink feed, I was like, right, I'm only gonna do like pastel pinks. But then I saw the next item, which I'm so close to showing you. Um, and then I just realized like, I'm gonna have to do that because it was just the most gorgeous thing I've ever seen in my life. You'll probably hate it. Um, <laughs> but then I got these shoes to go with it. XY London really kindly sent them to me. So I'm so excited to shoot that outfit. Okay, the last item. It is a gorgeous dress, again gifted by Misguided, but not for the purposes of this video. Look at it! Probably can't even see when it's not on. I'll try it on in a second. Um, but it is this beautiful, like, tall dress. Um, the camera really doesn't do this justice. I can already see. But it is so nice. I love it so much. Um, I feel like this is very uh, love it or hate it kind of vibe, but I think it's gorgeous. This is a size six and that is my usual size for a dress. I don't know when I will ever wear this apart from for a picture. Maybe if I go to a nice fancy event or something. I'm going to try everything on now for you, but let me know in the comments which your favourite item is. And a lot of them go together, so I'll probably try them on in like set outfits if you get me. So let's try them on. Okay, so this is the first outfit I'm trying on. This is the gorgeous coat, which I am so in love with. And yeah, the boots, they're just, oh, they're just all so perfect. I would wear this probably with a cream dress rather than black, but I can't for the life of me find my cream dress anywhere. I don't know where it is. I'm sure I had one. But I wore black for the pictures and I actually really liked it. They, they, I think they were my favorite pictures. But yeah, this is the coat up close. They look so nice together, like they tone, because they don't like match like exactly, but they tone really well together. I've got a picture of like the coat and the shoes together, I'll put it in now. And yeah, I just love how it looks, I think it looks so cool. So yeah, like this one's probably my favourite one, apart from the like bright pink one. It's definitely the favourite I actually took pictures in. I feel like the boots definitely make this outfit, but I just think it's the cutest outfit ever, like, oh, I'll probably rock up to uni in this, although actually. Maybe I wouldn't because I'll have to drive in the boots. Yeah, maybe that's not a good idea. But I would definitely be wearing this coat. I'll try on the next one. All right, for the next outfit, I have got my boots on again. And I've just got a little skirt on from Pretty Little Thing. I actually do not recommend this skirt at all. <laughs> it rides up every time you walk. But for the purposes of just standing here, it is fine. And then I've got this top the cable knit one. I've just tucked it in and just a little bit at the front because I feel like if it's untucked, it looks not quite as cute and then the ASOS hat kind of makes me look like a cowgirl I don't know why I think this because like it's not a cowgirl hat it's a bucket hat but I mean does anyone else get that vibe from this outfit because I definitely do but I still think it's kind of cute I'm not sure how in love with the hat I am I feel like I'm not it makes my head look huge but the top is definitely gorgeous I've said it already but I'll wear this a lot it's just super cute and comfy and I love it what I have been doing as well is I've been folding like this bit in because I get like I don't know why but it's been really irritating my neck every time I wear like a high neck thing and it's not my favorite thing to wear so I don't know why it's been irritating me so much but I folded this in and I haven't had any issues I think it looks quite nice like that as well so that's this one and I'm going to try on the jogger set next okay this is the jogger one I actually liked I know I said the one with the coat was my favorite pictures but if the lighting was better where I took this I love these pictures I've got a hat from New Look I got this for Christmas and the scarf is one I knitted myself, well, with a lot of help from my mum, but technically. So with this, it's very warm, but it's so comfy. Um, what I was doing was I was like tucking it up here, because I think it looked quite nice and it looked a bit more cropped. Um, yeah, I don't know. 
I like that vibe. It's super warm and cosy, like it's so lovely, especially for the colder days. I'm sweating so much right now, but this is so nice just because my room's a sauna. But yeah, I love it. Or if you wanted to wear it baggy and oversized, I like that look as well. I feel like this is one that you really can't go wrong with. You could put a coat on over the top, like it was quite cold when we were shooting, so I wore my pink fluffy coat over the top of this. It looked a bit extreme, but it was kind of cool. I felt very pink. This is definitely a very staple outfit. You could just wear this like every day, and I probably will. And I actually did shoes for this outfit. I know I did for the boots, but in hauls, I never normally bother with shoes, but I feel like I would definitely wear these white trainers with them. I like this vibe. So I've got two more outfits to try on now. So this is the next outfit. This is the one I said about the green trousers. I feel like it does contrast really nicely together. I love pink and green together. Yeah, the little blazer, it does look really cute on. Um, I'd possibly go for an oversized blazer, like a longer one. Um, I have got one somewhere, but I don't know where it is. But this looked cute for this outfit. It worked well. This isn't my personal favorite, but I think that's just because I really love the others. But the Primark top is so comfy. And yeah, this sort of fits really nicely like with the length that it matches up with the trousers because the trousers are quite high-waisted. I desperately need to get these trousers altered. They're ridiculously long. Um, they always get so dirty when I'm shooting as well because they obviously drag on the floor. But I do think this is quite like a cool vibe. It's possibly a bit too cool for me. And now I'm going to try on my favourite outfit. Okay, here it is. Oh, I just love this so much. I think it's just the most beautiful dress ever. And if you're telling me that you're not in love with this, then I'm sorry, but I don't believe you. I'm kidding, I know this is probably like nobody's taste. But I'm just obsessed with all the details of it. Like, I just love this. Look how cute it looks. And it possibly needs to like straighten out all like the ruffles and stuff. Like, just imagine this in a nice like museum or like some really fancy location in London. I don't know how I'm actually gonna get in there looking like this, but. And then I've got the shoes but these look so cool. The whole thing just goes so nicely together and it's just possibly my favourite, my most favourite outfit that I've ever worn or at least like top five, I think. I just feel like an actual fairy in this. I don't quite fit in my chair. It's so noisy as well, I don't know if that's picking up on camera. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video because it's like different to the normal hauls I do. If you like it when it's not just like a specific brand, if it's like a colour or a theme, let me know and I can do more videos like that. And also let me know in the comments which your favourite outfit was. Like I liked all of these but I mean, I don't know how I couldn't say this one. I'm so close to take pictures in this. I feel like an actual fairy. I love it so much. It would mean so much to me if you would like this video, comment and subscribe. And also turn on post notifications because I don't stick to an actual posting schedule. That will help me out so much. Yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and see you next time. Bye.